Okay, just doing a little update on the building of my barbecue island. As you can see, I've got it pretty much all framed out. I've just um, made these pieces, but I'm not going to install them until I get my grill, which should be arriving shortly. These ones I put in already. This is 18 gauge steel, so I couldn't cut it with snips. I had to grind it and then bend it, but it seems to work fine. Um, today, I did the wood flooring, the wood bottom, put that in, put down some of that um, Trex decking, and you can see with the slope from my patio, to make it level, I had to raise it a little. I also put in my wiring today. Just bought these at Home Depot, put them in. Bought the, um, I don't know what you call that. Anyways, this wire here came with all the, the wires in it, so it was real easy to install. I was real happy about that. Anyways, I'm getting ready for my next stage, which is going to be the backer board. And come over here. I bought Wonderlight. That's what they had at Home Depot. So I hope it works well. And right here is the saw that I've been using to cut all my um, metal studs. As you can see. I picked this up for about a hundred bucks at Home Depot. It's come in real handy. And I've also had to use this grinder for a few things. And let's see. I bought these clamps to use to hold together when I would when I'd be screwing in a screw. I'd clamp it to hold it together. And I actually found these ones to be a lot better than these. So these hold it a lot tighter and um, works really well. These clamp it real nice. When I bought the studs at a local um, metal shop, they sold me all these screws. I really don't, you really don't need that many. The guy really oversold me. But Anyway, so get a lot smaller one at Home Depot. And I'll show you the screws real quick just so that you can get an idea. You can see. I actually recommended shorter ones, but I went with the longer ones. And you can see when they go in, you need to get a little overhang. But of course, the um, cement board will cover all that up. But they're pretty flat. I used these screws when I secured the bottom decking boards to the bottom of the island. And you'll notice on these, they have a real sharp point. These screws, it says right here, metal to wood. I actually tried using some of my metal stud screws and it pushed the wood away. So these grab the wood and tighten it down real nice when I put in um, these boards down here. There's some screws going in. Here are the studs and channels I bought. This is 18 gauge steel. You can see it's, it's very thick. You can't cut this with snips. 
you may be able to cut the, the channel with snips, but um, there's no way you can cut a stud with it. So you're going to need a grinder to um, make some pieces like this. I just grinded it out there and then got a hammer and made it flat. And you can see when I screw it down, they um, attach rather nicely.